Something I could do I could be running or I'm chasing you But I won't Cause I got better, better things to do I'd rather spend my precious time Chasing somebody who loves me too If I got a dollar for Every time you slam the door I would be the richest girl alive Life, life If you hadn't run away Every time I asked you stay You would sleep right next to me tonight No, you didn't know me All you wanted was a game to play What up though? How y'all feel? Everybody good? It's your man, your friend, the fam member Braylon Lee here. And everything on this channel is alleged in my opinions for entertainment purposes only. Once again, everything on this channel is alleged in my opinions for entertainment purposes only. Once again, not once again, once again, everything on this channel is alleged in my opinions for entertainment purposes only. So listen, listen, listen. So shout out to a Queens team with Jai Jai Nan. Um, shout out to her. She just hit 500 subscribers. And one of the things that she said to me was, it may be hard, but you need to branch out. So I thought, okay, why not? I did do the Kiki Palmer video, gave my take on that. But listen, y'all, listen. So, you know, social media, as much bad as it can do, can also do a lot of good. So y'all, listen, there's this, you know, plus size, you know, fashion brand or clothing company called Shop Love Creed. And so Nazinga Amani from Zatima was doing what she was doing. I said, listen, wifey Nazinga Amani once again doing great things again. So I just, you know, I thought I posted it. She's liked other comments before, but she responded to it with a emoji with the hat with the happy emoji rather with the hearts around it. I'm like, oh my God. So then my behind goes to say, listen, I think that, you know, you inspire me every day as a content creator and as a better man. I would love to be hubby. Hashtag one step at a time. And so y'all probably wondering like, oh my God, Braylon, really? And listen, at the end of the day, you have not cut your ass now, but I'm going to tell you why I really do care for Nazinga Amani. This woman here is the personification of what it is to overcome any and every obstacle. I mean, really to me, and I said this in her bestie breakdown, because she asked who y'all celebrity crushes. I'm like, it's Jill Scott and her. You know what I mean? She's like a young version of Jill Scott. Like, the first time I ever saw her was her dancing on Instagram, right? And she is a dancer. Do you hear me? But then I saw shout to the Queen of Ratchet who is on YouTube. If y'all not subscribed to Queen of Ratchet, you're missing out on a good time. Because let me tell you something. <laughs> Queen of Ratchet takes all your Disney villains and just and just makes some sh shady women that just it's a hilarious time. And so, you know, Nazinga Mai is also a great singer that, you know, she did the black um little mermaid and she did a version of it that was just too too funny and you know her story um you know for those of you who don't know that you know her plate can she did share this on ig so i'm not sharing anything that is not public information i am not about that there are other people who are low down wasteful and just trash um, to use Forky's words from Toy Story, from the world of to Toy Story, that they will do things to bring people down, but I'm about lifting people up. But um, her place burned down and some other circumstances happened to her and she's always wanted to be an actress and she just put her, you know, feet to the pavement and, you know, she was a part of BET's um, a BT pilot for a show about um, curvy sisters as a you know sitcom and then you know she was on I think she was on sis sisters or sisters 
um, on BET Plus, and then she got to be on the spinoff show with Zatima, which is just popping right now. And then she just did a movie with Tay Diggs, and just she she is just so amazing. And every time that she posts, it's that signature smile that gets to me. And you know, I genuinely believe beyond all the likes, the sh- the reshares, the lives, all the things that she has to do from remembering her scripts to being on set all day to you know just all of the opportunities that are coming her way I genuinely feel that that is who she is that you know what you see is what you get and I have been looking for a relationship for a long time Um, and I think the reason why it probably has not happened for me really is because I've been forcing my schedule, my agenda, and my timeline, not realizing that it's God who's in control of all that. And, you know, I believe that you have not cut your ass, not life and death is in the power of your tongue. So, um, what you guys are seeing in the video, yes, that is the actual Nzinga Amani um, responding back to me. She's liked some other stuff before. But that one there just, and it's not, it, and, and she didn't have to do that. I guess the reason why I'm getting so emotional is because at the end of the day, old school love is hard to find. And I drew, tre- yeah, Lord Jesus, I genuinely believe that, you know, old school love still matters. Being able to open up the door for a woman still matters. Being able to pay for the bill still matters. Being able to do the small things in life still matter. Whether, you know, her favorite candy is, you know, um, I'm trying to think of the candy, y'all. Um, for example, Whoppers. Maybe her favorite candy is Whoppers. And guess what? You just go by her job and you just, you know, leave them in her drawer, you know, for her at work. You know, maybe there might be something of an opportunity that can help your queen rise. So you just let her know, hey, guess what? There's an opportunity. Um, and I put your name um, in, 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 in someone's head for them to remember you. And so you might be getting a call about opportunity. Or if, you know, they just need some time because you know something emotionally happened hey listen whatever you need i'm here you know and there's a video of a couple and i love this couple so much it is this bbw queen and this dark chocolate king and he is just lotioning her up in her thighs y'all know the video y'all know the video i'm talking about and honestly i want that type of love like it it's hard out here because it's just like I feel that because everybody has been played, everyone has been, you know, led astray and everybody's been wasted and everyone has had their time wasted. I think that's the reason why some people look at dating apps as entertainment now because nobody is being serious. But even though this was just a inch from a interaction, right, or inch of an interaction doesn't mean it can be a mile long opportunity of a blessing and to anyone and everyone out there that believe that you know impossible things don't happen um in the words of our fairy godmother um whitney houston god rest her soul she said impossible things are happening every day i said this in a video a while back that if we can talk about the mess of the impossible we should be able to talk about the rise of the possible. Once again, I'm going to say that two more times. If we can talk about the mess of the impossible, we should even talk about the rise of the possible. One more time for the one more time. If we are talking about the mess of the impossible, we should be able to talk about the rise of the possible. Even there was another comment that I made of Nazinga Amani, and she said Bryce has some competition. And guess what my behind said, y'all? I said, yes, he does. It. His name is Braylon and, uh, and my username on Instagram in her comment section. So, y'all, listen, slow and steady wins the race, okay? And I'm saying that to all the brothers out here because, let me tell you, there are some good brothers out here just like there are some good sisters out here. 
And it is sad that we are so separated from each other. But I will tell you this right from this space right here, right now. There is something on my vision board that says somewhere someone is looking for exactly what you have to offer. I'm going to say that two more times. Somewhere someone is looking for exactly what you have to offer. Somewhere someone is looking for exactly what you have to offer. When I first got on YouTube, and I'm sorry for that pause, but I needed that pause because there's a lot of thoughts going in my head. When I first got on YouTube, I did not know how to be a voice in billions of voices or within the billions of voices. But, I, but what I've come to realize is there's always a space for you to do something that's never been done before, for you to do a style that's never been seen before. But bigger than all of that, there's always a chance for you to create a space that people have been looking for. And I may think I'm teen too much in the words of Tamar Esteen Braxton, but apparently y'all don't mind being on team too much for me either. And that's the same thing with dating, relationships, you know, of any kind, marriage, parenting, health, whatever area of life you're looking for. You may feel like it is too much for somebody to take on, but I promise you somebody somewhere is looking for exactly what you have to offer. And, you know, every person that makes it in life, just because they made it in their life, doesn't mean they don't have problems in their life. Just because Nzinga Amani has made it, which I believe she is just at the beginning of her making it, but she has made it. Just because she's there doesn't mean that she's not looking for somebody that can be a solution of, listen, that's a part of my life, but that's not everything of my life. I want, some, I want someone who can be everything of my life that allows me to be the best of me. And I'm not saying I'm the best. I'm not saying I'm the worst. I'm probably number 100 on the short list, but at least I made the list because somebody believes enough in me to be a solution. And I would love to be that solution for Nzinga Amani within good time. So I just wanted to make this video just to say thank you, Nzinga. I love you. I value, I embrace you. I cherish you and everything in between. And please, like I said, keep your head up with how far you've come. Keep your head down, your purpose. Move forward to the blessings in front of you. Leave those curses behind you. And at the end of the day, you are so here for a purpose way bigger than what you know. But in the meantime, between time, I just want you to know that your purpose to me is to honestly bring that name of Nzinga to life and put the zing in everything you do to show that no matter who you are, where you come from, that everybody zing lights the world up. And for your presence being in the world, it definitely makes my world better. And I would not have it any other way. Anyway, like, comment, share, and subscribe. This has been another edition of Brayley's Virtual Door Pit Stop. Leave your thoughts in the comments below. I know you will have comments. Um, and Nzinga, if you see this, this is nothing but one love, much love, and all love to you. And I, and I hope I didn't do the most by doing this video. But also, to like Queen, the Queen C of Jai Jai Nan said, if I have this much passion for love and marriage, Huntsville, there has to be more to me than just a reality show. Love you all. Have a great weekend. And, you know, of course, I'm still around here on these YouTube streets. So, you know, if you ever want to connect with me, I'm always responding to the comment section. And my community tab, too. You can always respond to me over there as well. All right. Love you all. Bye. Tell you something I could do I could be running or I'm chasing you But I won't Cause I got better, better things to do I'd rather spend my precious time Chasing somebody who loves me too If I got a dollar for Every time you slam the door I would be the richest girl alive Life, life If you hadn't run away Every time I asked you stay You would sleep right next to me tonight But you didn't want me, or you didn't